Dr. Weke, I will say, I don't know whether it's one of the biggest issues that we are having in our country today. You see couples, they have issues, they bring it on social media. They, whatever, they buy, get new thing, they bring it up on social media. Whatever thing they do, they bring it to social media. Yeah. It, do you think social media has a capacity of actually solving marital issues? Do you think it has a way of, of bonding family? Because most of them are hiding under content now. We are creating content, they bring their children up there and forgetting about the insecurity. And now the, the uh, police uh, spokesperson has come to say, they should be very careful what they post on social media if it is affecting them negatively. But again, will it be easy and possible for them to regulate by, a mere, a mere, by me telling them just to abstain from it without doing something else about it? Yeah, I think what police is saying has a, any, any information police passes to us is a very critical issue. It's something to be taken serious. It's a security tip, right? Mm. So you can do social, uh, you can be a content creator without uh, involving your family. And if you must also post something about two adults, that is yourself and your partner, the other person must consent to it. So it shouldn't come like a shocker, except you are posting yourself. Mm. In some cases, too, the husbands will ask a wife, you know the way it is done in Af around uh, culture. You almost everything the wife want to take permission from the husband. So if you have that kind of husband too, that will say, I'm seeing this picture, they even tell me. Eh? Mm. Hey, when did this, you know, stuff like that. So to that extent too, you can also let your partner know. More so when you have to post pictures involving you, the partner and then the children. It has to be, if that I'm trying to see how we can weed off this aspect of people complaining that it's affecting them negatively. If it, they, it was sent on their consent, they won't say such, uh, so they will take full responsibility. It means the other partner just posted without informing them. I don't know if I get what I'm saying. Then the security aspect, we've heard stories where people after first posting maybe on the airport or the trains uh, area that on our way to holiday, that you are just seeing the whole family on our way uh, to a holiday and then the, the neighbor, the criminals in the neighborhood will inform the criminals that are not close by <laughs> about cop. He said, you don't even need to come, we've gone. They've gone. Just come. We'll take our time. Eh? We'll just take our time. Don't be in a holiday. They say, they even posted there that it's two weeks holiday. So, <laughs> so what we'll do is that, you just take your time. Come around 5 p.m. Hmm? <laughs> You know, when they come, you know, you've, you've seen it before. Somebody comes in, everything is blank. They've mm. stolen everything. Uh, especially on Sundays, you say, on my way to church, after service, before service, <laughs> you know, that kind of thing. So uh, there, are, there could be thieves in the neighborhood or not necessarily in the neighborhood. Uh, thieves that might know your address and where you live. They can take advantage of your absence from home to attack. Or if you also show uh, parents... So there are things you post, or people might start asking you questions. Hey, how about the children now? Uh, posing to be close friends. But he said, no, they are with their auntie. <laughs> they know that you and their mom have gone. So, eh, 